This water and pepper experiment is going viral online. Parents and teachers are using it to demonstrate the benefits of soap. The pepper floating on top of the water represents the virus. When the virus comes in contact with soap, it looks to run away. What happened? The virus went away. Why did it go away? It doesn't like soap. Exactly. I wanted to give this experiment a try. So I've got the cleaning power of soap on my finger. I put it into the virus and there it goes. Now here's the science behind why that works. As we all know, water has surface tension. You see that when you add drops and drops of water to a cup and you get that meniscus over the top of it. That's a cohesion or a tension of the water molecules trying to hold each other together and it allows for what we call surface tension. When you put the pepper on top of the surface of the water, pepper is what's known as hydrophobic. It doesn't like water and it's very light. So it just sits on the very top layer floating there like that. Now if I take detergent or soap and I place it on my finger, Detergent has hydrophobic and hydrophilic ends, uh, parts that really like water and parts that really don't like water. And so when I put my soapy finger into the water that I've got collected in the plate, then it breaks up the surface tension in that region. Now the rest of the water itself, that film of water wants to maintain its surface tension. And so the water molecules shoot across and actually drag all the pepper with it. And since the pepper in this experiment represents the virus, it's a great visual for children, helping them understand the power of soap. This just shows how important washing your hands is to protecting yourself from the coronavirus. Because as you can see, your vi the virus ain't going nowhere close to your finger. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention says hand hygiene is considered a primary measure for reducing the risk of transmitting infection among patients and healthcare personnel.